Welcome to the demonstration that shows how to add a Google gadget called a motion graph to a Google spreadsheet. I've already selected a data set and a range, so to add the gadget I click on Insert, Gadget, I'm going to choose Add to Spreadsheet for a Motion Chart. That will add in the gadget. I've already chosen the range. I will title it Plant Height Over Time and click Apply and Close. This is going to add the gadget directly to this spreadsheet. However, I would like to make it a separate sheet so that I can really take a look at this. So I'm going to pull the menu down and click on Move to Own Sheet. That will open up a new sheet in this spreadsheet that contains our new motion graph. Now I want to change the axes. I want the Y axis to be the height of the plant, so I select height. I want the X axis to be time, so I select time. You'll notice that I have different colors for the different soil types, but I'd really like to look at the different crops. So in this example, beans will be blue, corn will be green, and tomatoes will be yellow. I would also like to take a look at the number of leaves that were generated according to the size of these dots. So you can see, for this student's data, there were four leaves on January 19th, and for this student's data on a corn plant, there were two leaves on January 19th. I'd also like to take a look at trails for a select group of students. So I'm going to turn on four particular students. And now I have my motion graph set up and ready to play. I simply click on the play button. And here we can watch the growth of the plants in height, the y-axis, over time, the x-axis. And you'll see that the green color, or the corn, is growing faster than the blue the beans or the yellow, the tomatoes. We can also see the number of leaves and we can determine which of the students this data belong to by keeping our trails on. I hope you enjoyed this video.